we have a very interesting program that again is a tr potentially transformational therapy in multiple sclerosis. And this program relies on a number of studies that over many years have shown an association between Epstein-Barr virus infection and multiple sclerosis. From this association, we believe there could be a clear causal relationship where the latent infection by EBV in B cells of some patients with MS is really the triggering factor for the progression of the symptoms there. And that means that addressing that particular infection, latent infection in hunting and killing these B cells infected by EBV in MS patient could lead to significant improvement in their symptoms, particularly so in progressive MS. And we've done already a phase one study with 8188, which is a product we are making that is specifically designed to address the EBV antigens that are always present in MS patients. And this product has been used uh, in uh, more than 24 patients in our phase 1A in an open study and shows not only safety at different dose level, but also some encouraging signal of potential efficacy in improving disability. And that could therefore be transformational because at this stage, no treatment is approved in MS, in progressive MS, to be able to reverse the disease to improve disability. So that could very well be the first of this kind if we're able to prove that through the randomized control trial that has just started, where we compare 8188, this specific product designed as an allogenic EBV T cell therapy to address uh, the need of MS patients. We compare these to placebo in progressive MS patient, and we should have a first clinical data next year in the first half of 22. Uh, on these randomized clinical trials through an interim analysis that uh, we are preparing right now. So that's a very exciting time to be able to change the life of patients with progressive MS. And of course, if it works there beyond that, we can go also in relapse remitting MS in particular to be able to address a possible root cause of the disease, which is this latent infection with Epstein-Barr virus as a triggering factor of the autoreactive B cell and antibodies that are destroying myelin in this patient with multiple sclerosis. Mm -hmm.